So, you're looking to remodel your bathroom. If you're considering a glass block shower, you may already be aware of some of the benefits of doing so, like the ease of maintenance, the potential to consider universal design concepts like a barrier-free entry, or the numerous aesthetic options available to enhance your shower space, like having a curved glass block wall. But without the experience of having done anything quite like this, the idea of installing something like a curved glass block wall may seem more intimidating than it needs to. The first step to installing a curved glass block shower wall is to purchase a pre-made, ready-for-tile shower base that is designed to accommodate the curve of the wall and fit into your space. These bases are waterproof and are custom made to fit the specifications of the glass block wall you will be installing. The next step is to purchase pre-made glass block wall sections that are made to fit your shower design. That means that the wall is pre-made, generally in 10 to 15 block sections, and shipped to you for installation. The size of these wall sections are more manageable than using larger sections and will save you the hassle of building the entire wall from scratch. In this particular project, the sections are built in a stair-step fashion. The interlocking sections are easier to install for this larger curved wall, provide more structural stability during the installation, and will be cosmetically invisible once the grout is applied. The glass block wall will need to be anchored to the adjoining wall sides, also called jams, to keep it from falling over. To drill the holes for the wall anchors, you will need a drill and a masonry bit. Using a pencil, you should pre-mark precisely where the wall sections will sit on the curb cap of the shower base to give yourself a visual guide. The first thing to be attached to the curb cap is a layer of vinyl stack material. This is the same stacking material used in between the individual glass blocks when the sections are pre-made. The bottom section of the wall will stack on this material. The vinyl stack system uses what's called an arc spacer to allow you to conform the layout of the vinyl stack pieces to the curvature of the wall section. The vinyl spacers are built into the pre-made walls and will leave an eighth inch gap between the glass blocks. At this point, you will need to apply silicone to the bottom of the vinyl stack pieces and apply them to the curb cap. Apply some pressure to the vinyl stack and wipe away any excess silicone that seeps out the sides. Once your markings are made, your vinyl stack section is in place, and your anchor holes are drilled, apply a quarter inch bead of silicone to the bottom of the first wall section. Then put the wall section into place on the vinyl stack. It's important at this time to make sure that the wall section is level. If you check the level after each wall section is installed, the wall should remain properly level. After the wall section is in place, anchor the wall section into the holes you drilled previously using 3 inch stainless steel drywall screws. The stainless steel screws will resist corrosion better than other screws. Next, you will apply a bead of silicone to the top of the glass block pre-made section and set the second wall section in place. Make sure once again that it is level. It's now time to begin the process again by installing the next wall section and anchoring it to the wall jam.
Make your way from the wall jam outwards again and again until the last section of the wall is in place. The wall is now completely installed, and after waiting a few hours, should be ready for the grouting process. If this is your first glass block wall installation, or if you're unsure of yourself, it may be wise to let the silicone joints cure overnight and begin grouting the next day. Since silicone is a slightly flexible material, the wall will have a tendency to sway until grouting is completed anyways, so the extra curing time should come in handy for a beginner, as the silicone will be more adhered to the wall joints when grouting begins. If you take the time to install this shower system properly, your bathroom can be transformed from being simply a functionally necessary space to being a space that is as easy to maintain as it is to enjoy.